Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another video. Today I am cash planning for the week. I have 413 that I will be putting into my envelopes for the week. And I'm going to first start off in my wallet, which I actually already figured out the amounts. It's 170. I put the same amount usually for each week. And this week I'm going to put 30 in spending, 30 in eating out. Groceries will get 80. Coffee will get 20 and buffer will get 10. So that'll be the 170 that's going into my wallet. So let me start subtracting that over here. All right, so I'm left with 243, which I plan on putting into, try to get all of my envelopes, all of my savings challenges filled. Um, so there's probably gonna be a lot of fives going into envelopes this week. Yeah, lots of five into envelopes, so that way each one will get something. Um, but I am going to prioritize some envelopes over others first. So, first one up I'm going to do is emergency. This one is going to get $20 this week. So is extra savings. And also my treat yourself envelope. I like to match all these amounts together because I feel like these are like the really, really important ones. Yeah, having an emergency fund is very important for just those random things that pop up that you didn't plan for. Just so that way, you know, like for me, I don't have to go to a credit card and put something on credit and then end up end ending up having to pay interest on that because I can't pay it off right away. So um, emergency fund, I have, let's see. 22.50 in here. I've had to dip into this a couple of times already. Um, so it's come in super, super handy. My goal for this one is 3000, but honestly, I'm just gonna keep going and adding money into it just to make it a nice big pot of money for me to um, have just in case I need it. But I feel like 3000 is a good amount for um, emergencies that might come up, at least for me, because I don't own a home, so I don't have like at least home emergencies um but i do have my car and just if anything else were to happen um i could dip into this for yeah it's there if i need it but i i like the my goal is three thousand but i will have more than that in there um after i reach three three thousand and then extra savings this i've just been dumping into my savings at the end of the month um this has been nice too because it's just getting more and more savings into my bank account. Yeah, I have like the more fun savings challenges that I put money into, but then I also just have this too. Um, I feel like the more savings, the better. So this has been super handy. And then with all of that, that stuff, which isn't so much fun, like saving for all that, I do try to prioritize my treat yourself so I can get myself something really, really nice. Um, something expensive because I do have expensive taste when it comes to handbags. That's like my one thing is handbags. I don't really care about any other stuff. Like I drive um, a Corolla. I don't care about like nice, nice, fancy cars. Um, I don't care about uh, like my clothes are pretty basic too. Um, but handbags, I do like to spend money on handbags because I feel like it's definitely worth it, like the quality and all that. So that's what I plan on buying with this money. And actually, I'll probably be buying something for myself with this money in December. So coming up soon. Um, because I wanted to get myself a Christmas slash early birthday present. from. So I'll probably be taking you along if you watch my Shop With Me videos to go and do that. So this one's going to get $20 this week. Treat yourself. Okay, so those are the ones I wanted to prioritize. 183 is left. Um, and then, oh, speaking of my car, because I brought it up, because um, I do drive a uh, Corolla, a Toyota Corolla, and it is, I think, it's almost 10 years old, so it's like eight years old. Um, never had any issues with it. The only issues I've ever had with my car um, have been the paint, but it was a recall, so they've Toyota's fixed it for free thankfully repainted my car 
Um, other than that, I've never had any issues with my car, but I do make sure to keep up on my maintenance. Um, and then of course tires. I have, I don't think I need two new tires yet. So I have 335 here. I, I will be taking my car to get an um, oil change soon. And I don't know if there's anything else that they're going to recommend that I need to do, but I will review that once that comes. So right now I have 335 and I think I'm just going to put 20 bucks in here too, just because I know I'm going soon. And it's been nice, like going to, going to take my car in and yeah, it's been nice being able to take my car in to get service. And like, if they, if there are issues, like sometimes they'll tell me, something with the brakes needs to be changed or things that sound important. Like if they tell me my windshield wipers need to be replaced, I'm not doing that with them. Like there's certain things that I know I, I'm just gonna have them do versus like I could do it myself or I could ask my coworker to do it, um, things like that. But I like that, I've, it's really nice to have uh, this this envelope. Also, if I need to pull from my, my um, emergency money for anything that comes up for my car because in the past when that had ha has happened I would have to put that on a credit card or I have to wipe out my whole account and I was never prepared for it so it just it, it may, it's less stressful going to get my car maintenance done um and yeah it's just a good feeling so I definitely definitely suggest if you're starting off with this system and if you have a car, this is a pretty important envelope to have. I'm actually gonna change this for next year to just say auto. So this will fund, it does right now, but right now it just says auto repair. But I also want it to fund like car washes, um, maintenance to like my car, anything I need to buy like cleaning supplies that I'll buy for my car. Um, anything car related will be funded from this one. But yeah. Okay, auto repair, super important. Um, all right, next one is electronics. This one isn't like a huge priority. I have 26 in here, so I'm just gonna put five. Okay, I'm just gonna double check my totals because sometimes when I talk, I forget what I did. <laughs> um, so 20, hold on, let me do this again. 15, 170, 20, five, 20, 20 and 20. Okay, 158. Um, emergencies done, extra savings done. Furniture is not a huge priority, so that's getting five as well. Rainy day. I'm going to put 10 in here. Registration is fully funded. Road trip will get 10 as well. Because I'm going out of town the ne next weekend, and that'll get me to the amount I like to have in here for that envelope. Scent seat, not a huge priority. That's getting five. Okay, subscriptions is getting five. And travel, we'll get five. All right, and then I did forget to do another envelope first. I'm actually gonna go into my savings binder. And there's like a little game I like to play in here. So let me get that first. I move on to the other ones okay so this power up right here we get a die the dice and a sticky note all right so first I'm gonna roll to see how many times I'm rolling for this challenge all right I got five so let's see what that gets me for this challenge so five and six is a star, that's a dollar. And then five, oops, and four. Five and four is a mushroom, so that's five. Five and one is a star, it's a dollar. Lots of fives, five and four. Five and four is a star, that's a dollar. Last roll, six and three is a star. Okay, so that's five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine dollars will go into this challenge, not too bad. Okay, so I'm gonna put power up down here. 
nine dollars and subtract that okay i will come back to this binder in a bit i'm gonna move on to this one <clears throat> so beauty i already have 50 so i'm just gonna put five in here so i'm running low on money now clothing we'll get five yeah i have 50 in here so it's fine content we'll get five costco five family five gifts we'll get five home we'll get five I actually have decent amounts in these envelopes so not too don't really need too much household will get five and target will get five <clears throat> okay so I'm up at 64 so next will be the pink binder. Go wild. I'm just gonna put five in everything because I'm running low on money. So Disneyland, five is fine. Holiday decor, five. Christmas, five. Fun, five. To treat yourself and hobbies will get five okay i'm left with 34 and i still have a bunch of savings challenges so we'll see how far this goes okay so again lots of fives ten dollar challenge we'll get ten now i do have money left over in my wallet so this will get um Whatever's left over will get that money. Um, I did have, I'm gonna do one in here, $10 challenge, one in the $5 challenge. I already did this challenge. I have the 52 circle. This one's just gonna get a dollar this week, $1. But I could bump it up with some extra money that I have in my wallet. So it might get more than that. And then I have my 100 envelope challenge will get five that's been my start off point for this for this challenge i always start with like five and then i end up bumping it up to more and then i have my cash stash which i know i will not be able to um oh i need to move it actually because it's still back here so i will not be able to um, I'm just going to leave it here for now. I won't be able to fill in one of these because they're pretty high numbers. Um, and for this week, I don't want to, obviously I can't. So what might happen is I can plan to put like say 10 and then I might have 15 in here. I could put in here, or if I don't have 15 to make this 25, um, I'll just roll it over to the next week, like make a little note for myself that I have 10 and then ne maybe next week I can do 15 and then I'll be able to color one in. So it might take a little bit longer, but honestly, that's just how it's going to have to be. So I'm going to plan for 10 because I have 13 left and I feel like 10 is a good number. So I'll do cash dash. We'll get 10. I'm left with $3, which is going to be for my dollar challenge, and that's everything. That should be everything. I really hope I didn't mess up that total because everything, at least every envelope got something, and I don't have to worry about that. I did my job with that. That was my goal. Um, so hopefully I didn't mess up the totals anywhere. But I'm just going to double check it just to make sure I am correct in that, that all of this equals totals out to 413 Good news, I didn't mess it up. So now I'm just gonna figure out the tallies. Um, again, okay, asking for lots of fives when I go to the bank today. Auto repair, that's a $20 bill. And then I have a five here. Emergency is a $20 bill. And so is extra savings. Furniture is five. Um, rainy day and road trip are 10. And then I have all these fives. This whole section is just fives. So I'm gonna go here to here, 
with fives. Okay, and then I have a 20 for, oops, I already messed up. So I have a 20 for treat yourself. And then another five, I have nine, it's five, six, seven, eight, nine. $10 for $10 challenge, and then $5 for the $5 challenge, a dollar for the 52 circle, 100 envelope is five, cash dash is 10, and I have three for the dollar challenge. Count the tallies, so that's 150, 20, three, four, five, six, seven. 10s, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 5s, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, fives. And then 1s, I have 5, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, so 50s, or 50 as one, Tw seven twenties is 140, nine tens is 90, 24 fives is 120, and then 13 ones, 13. So the total is 50, 140, 90, 120, and 13, which is a total of 413, perfect. So what I'm gonna do now is just write on my little sticky note here that I need 50s, I need one, that is $50. 20s, I need seven, that's a total of 140. 10s, I need nine, that's 90. Fives, I need 24, that's 120. And ones, I need 13, that's $13. And that is a total of 413. Okay, so when I go to the bank today, that's what I'll be asking for from the teller. And I'm just gonna put this in my wallet and then I'll be good to go to get that money. All right, for my cash stuffing, which I will post on Sunday. So definitely, if you're not already, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're not already. Um, and hopefully I'll see you then for this cash stuffing video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, make sure to hit that subscribe button and I will see you in the next one.